That's actually about as eloquent as I can be with that title. So two things here I want to talk about. Uh, my Play Direct and UPS. I ordered something from My Play Direct and they delivered it by UPS. I would never have chosen UPS. I'm going to talk about them first. Now, there's a reason these guys have a reputation as being a lousy company and are often referred to as oops. Tuesday, August 27th, 2013. Package was left at my door. We're talking a huge package, about two feet wide. Doorbell rings, and as I get to the door, I see the UPS truck driving off. There was no real attempt to see if anyone was home. Thankfully, I was. It could have easily been stolen. Someone else could have grabbed it. There would have been no accountability. Now, sadly, this is not the first time I've heard about something like this from UPS. Do I even need to mention that the one of the corners of the package was dented? I might as well throw that in. Yes, uh, there was a corner dented as well. And again, this is not my choice. I never would have used UPS. So I wanted to complain to my Play Direct and let them know exactly what happened. And just uh, in the hopes of maybe preventing this from happening to another customer. Maybe try to discourage them from using UPS. It's a long shot, but at the very least, I figure every complaint helps. Now, I get to the website of my Play Direct, and it's pretty obvious they're not really interested in customer service. Here's a rule of thumb I go by. If I don't see a lot of ways that you can be reached as a company, that tells me you've got something to hide. It tells me that you probably get a lot of complaints and you're tired of hearing the complaints. You're not really interested in fixing anything. You've got a who cares attitude. A company that has multiple ways of being reached uh, or doesn't hide the contact information, that tells me that you are welcoming customer feedback and you strive to improve and be a better company. That's pretty straightforward, and I'll give you an example exactly of what I'm talking about with this. Here's another completely different company. You've got Zappos Shoes, and if you look at the top left-hand corner, what do you got? There's their 800 number, 24 hours. Call us, reach us, talk to us. We want to hear from you. That's the message I'm getting from them. But back to Schmucks Incorporated, a.k.a. My Play Direct. Here's their website, or at least part of it, the top half. You'll see that in the upper right hand corner there is a contact us information link and you will also notice that it is at the bottom of the page like so unfortunately what do those links lead to some drop down menus and those are always fun here's what you get so you start off with three different options and they are as follows you've got Questions about an existing order, problems, and all others. Now, I went with all others because it wasn't a question about an existing order. And when I click all other questions, what are my options right there? Well, they're fantastic. Website, non-order issues. So that wasn't the right issue. So I had to go back to questions. Fine, I do that. And there are the options that come along. And again, none of them really fit. You look for further elaboration. And once again, nothing that really fits the problem at hand. So I figured, hey, I'm already at this website. Maybe I could learn a little bit about the company, get a little bit of a background, find out what's going on. Here's what you get if you get to their About page. Okay, well, maybe there's an FAQ. Let's see the FAQ page. That actually did tell me everything I needed to know. So in conclusion, screw you, my play direct. You've lost a customer for life. Uh, hopefully, I can encourage a few other people to never use them. It's just a sad case of another company that's run by pinheads who have their heads up their asses and really have no interest in customer service. And one more word before I go. Uh, avoid UPS, of course. Try and support companies that don't have employees that leave packages out in the open where they can be easily stolen. I don't know, that just seems like common sense to me, but I thought it might be worth mentioning. And as always, thanks for watching. Bye.